that's a it's a it's a hard that's a hard question. Um, I hope I hope I have I have hope and belief. That's partly why I'm here uh, with my kids because um, it needs to happen. Um, the U.S. was built. Racism, white supremacy, is in the the DNA of the United States, um, and so it is. It is not going to be a quick and easy solution. There is no quick and easy solution. Um, white people need to. We have the power. We. I. I have. I have the power. Um, in this society, economics, politics. Uh, we need to be part of the solution because we're accountable. We need to be accountable because uh, we're responsible. Um, but we also need to listen. Uh, I can't be the leader. I can't say what needs to happen. Um, we need to listen to the African American community. The, there's many communities in the United States uh, and in Canada that have been uh, that have been um, uh, experiencing injustice, systemic injustice, and so. Um, we, white people, that have the power need to listen to those communities, which has not happened. And that's when an eruption like the, the, the protests after the death, the very visible, painful, uh, visceral death on camera of George Floyd, um, we need to listen to those that are in pain, that are angry, that, that uh, you know, that have... Uh, exploded in our city, the emotions that have exploded in our city. Um, there's righteous anger, there's righteous protest. Much of the destruction uh, has happened um, not, not led by that community that has the righteous anger necessarily, but it's part of it. And I can't, I can't say those protesters had nothing to do with the destruction of, of my neighborhood uh, because I think in some ways they, they were part of it but I don't blame them because it's, it comes from the deep pain, the deep injustices that exist. And so um, I'm here to help uh, put a Band-Aid on the situation. I'm here to volunteer at this church that's doing a food drive. And, um, but I'm also committed and my family's committed to being part of the long-term solution, to listening, uh, to supporting, lifting up the voices that have not been heard in this country.